Easy E was a big part of yes, sir. me. Business wise. Because business wise, because when I came down to LA, went to the swap meets, you know, in in, in LA, Easy E opened up his arms to me and said, Man, I'm gonna bring you to Julio G. Mm. That's how I got my first song on the radio. What? He took you to Julio the G? Man took me straight up there, Snoop. Shout Straight out to up. Julio G, my labor buddy from 1580 K-Day. Not 93.5 K-Day, but 1580 K-Day. Yeah. The real. Yeah, and it was, it was on after that, man. I was, so they had a record out. They had Bloods in the Crips. That was one of the biggest records out. The gang time. banging on wax. Yeah. Battle Cat then, produced that. Yeah, and then it was me. He was taking every, everywhere. And I'm like, man, I was putting my own posters up. I'm in every hood in L.A. And just, man. He was networking, P, on some real shit. Yeah. And at that time, Bloods and Crips didn't get along. Nah. So for you to be going in all those neighborhoods, networking, doing your business, and showed that you really was about your business.